Hello my friends, Somrealist here to play a demo of Wood and Weather. Unlike the previous games um, that I've made videos on this past week, this is not part of the Steam Next Fest, the current one that is, in February 2024, but it was one of the previous ones, and I've had this demo download downloaded from them <laughs> this whole time, and it's still available, so although um, I'm not doing this technically as part of this year's Steam Next Fest, I am still playing a demo that used to be <laughs> part of a Steam Next Fest. Uh, let's go ahead and get started. This game isn't released yet as of recording this. Uh, the store page says coming soon, so it might be in the future. Just so you know, this is just a little demo scene, a sample, a taste, a snippet, a nibble, a drizzle of the full experience. We hope you like flying around as a weird blue hand in a bunch of different weather. Thank you for your support. You're an inspiration. So it did recommend that I play with a controller um, as soon as I started the game. Oh dear, oh dear. I was trying out my new spell to be able to predict the weather, but the experiment went wrong and I ended up trapping all of the weather in this contraption. And for the life of me, I can't seem to get it back out. I fear we might never have any weather again. Oh dear, oh dear. <laughs> Don't worry, strange no man. I, I will assist. <laughs> So the premise of this game, as you have seen, is that you are the weather. So we're using left toggle to move, R to descend, okay, so the right toggle. Interesting, interesting, okay, we'll, we'll, we'll descend down to speak to them. We're pointing at them, that's funny. Did you just come out of my magical contraption? Fascinating! My name is Zoltan, and I am a magical wizard. Can you help me fix my contraption? It's very important that I release the weather trapped inside. Try uh, giving that lever up there a pull. Why can't you pull that? All right. Oop. Um, it reminds me of a game that I've been wanting to play, where you play as an angry cloud. <laughs> I don't know if it's in my library or not. I'll have to look. Um, but that one, it's called like Rain on Your Parade, I think. No, that didn't work. Well, I'm all out of ideas. <laughs> if only I had some more inspiration. You see, inspiration is what gives my magic its power. It can come from anywhere if you know where to look. Inspiration, a kite stuck in a tree. Give me inspiration and perhaps I can release the weather. Oh, you are so irresponsible. Okay, and then we can use the right toggle as well to rotate the camera, okay. And we use left and right to move around. Let's descend to this mortal. Oh, did you see? The, the hand made like a like a walking motion. Yeah, look. <laughs> if I'm, okay, well, I, I thought I had to hold it down, but I guess you just hold it down until you're on ground level and then you can walk. That's pretty silly. Talk to. I was flying my kite when all of a sudden the wind died. The kite fell right into this tree. Could you get it out for me? Sure, Elizabeth. I will stroll on over. Um, how do I how do I ascend from walking on the ground? Wow, what a what a close up. Um, how do I? Yeah, how do I how do I how do I get up? Um, I would I would like to no longer be on the ground. This was really fun, but I don't know how to get up off the ground. <laughs> uh, please ascend. Uh oh. I, I thought I discovered something really fun, but I don't know how to get out of this now. Okay, I'm pressing left trigger, right trigger, left button, right button, uh, left toggle just lets me walk, right toggle moves the camera. Oh, okay, I don't, I don't know how I got up, but I, I guess I should never walk again. This is why gods should not walk among men. <laughs> All right, grabbing that, here you go. I still can't fly it, but thanks. You're an inspiration! Zero four, or one of four. Okay, well, glad you got your kite back. Great! You helped someone out and collected inspiration. Just a little bit more and we should have enough. When you need some more inspiration, it's a good idea to jot things down. That's why I invented the Compendium. In the Compendium, you can collect inspiration from everything you find and everyone you meet. You can open the Compendium at any time by pressing that button. Why don't you collect some inspiration from the Compendium? I'll wait here. 
talk to take oh that's the pause okay Ooh. okay so kite flies in the sky there's a bottle a truck fragile container for gifts a polite way to say don't go here traffic cone a tool used to retrieve curiosities from water fishing pull i guess the, the suction is a little different than i'm used to seeing from a hook um, an appliance found on wet buildings in very hot weather a brick a large toy that floats in water i'm sure it's a beach ball and then a vehicle that goes from one place to another it's a car um how do i okay so i have to click it to collect inspiration Okay, and then the left and right shoulder buttons let you change stuff. Uh, a weathered curiosity often lost in waterways, like a shoe, I guess, um, can often be found fishing by the lake. Sultan mythology, a magical inventor of contraptions. Collect inspiration from you, I guess. I can set them as my best friend. <laughs> uh, can be found attending to the various beehives of the city. Expert at building large things. Can usually be found pottering around the veggie patch. Born with naturally reflective skin and excels in standing very still. Is this like a golden monopoly man? Uh, always looking for new... Oh! Uh, I guess it's like one of those like statue people in like Times Square in New York. Or I guess other big cities where they dress up in costume. Always looking for new opportunities to make money. Elizabeth Rose Hoke enjoys cold drinks when it's hot. And hot drinks when it's cold. Okay, that's a normal thing. I thought it was like a cold drink when it's cold weather person. I, I can't. I can't do that. Okay, we got inspiration from them. We'll set them as my best friend. Friendship friendship over. It was cool until you got to know him. Responsible for maintaining the quality of waterways in and around the city. Is capable of carrying weights upwards of one kilogram. Enjoys listening to music genres you've probably never heard of. Uh, a frosty friend of Ritu's with a strong preference for cold weather. So some sort of snowman. Um, plant are hiding in a fluffy water container. Oh, so like a cloud. Animal found in small bodies of water. A fish. A plant that we found in snowy weather. Like a pine tree. Um, a plant that grows at high altitudes in rainy weather. Okay, there's a lot of things. I wonder if we'll get to all of these in the demo. Probably not. Apple. Sweet drink that is somewhat somehow chewy. Oh, like boba. Eaten in snowy weather. I don't know if you eat carrots in snowy weather. <laughs> okay, there's a lot of stuff. Oh, that should be enough to get the contraption running. Okay, all we have to do is read our compendium. Try pulling the weather again. Okay. Let's uh, let's go up and never walk on the ground again because <laughs> I don't know how to get back out. Okay, we'll pull that. Yeah, the controls are a little silly. Um, rain, cloud, or sun. I guess we only have enough for sun. It worked! Some of the weather is back. As you can see, there's plenty more weather to discover, and there's a whole world of inspiration out there to make it happen. However, you are only playing the demo of wooden weather, of course. In this demo, there are only three weather states. The full game will have many more. And right now, you only have access to a small portion of the full game world. Please await the full release of wooden weather to see everything we've made for you. But for now, go out and see what you can find. I feel like three weather conditions is still plenty. All right, well, let's hang around in the sun. Ooh, we can grab. <laughs> oh, okay. Let's... Sorry, bush. Um... <laughs> let's keep uprooting things. A tree. Oh no, let's let's let go of that. Can I can I put this back? I, it felt like I could put the tree back. Um, yeah, the. Uh, the controls seem a little funny. Okay, yeah, plant is just A. Um, I'm curious why it was like specifically recommended. I want to collect you. Okay, I can't collect them. Um, 
yeah, why I was specifically recommended to use a controller. I feel like you could do probably the same thing. Oh, I don't want the tree. Uh, probably the same thing a little easier or at least equivalent with um, mouse and keyboard. At least for mouse and keyboard, you can like choose what you want to pick up more easily. But maybe that's part of the, the fun is to make it a little hard too. Oh, bubble tea. I will talk to the statue. Clementine! <laughs> uh-huh. You are a real person, definitely. Okay, that was just a leaf. I was like, is that a frog? A little bird? Okay, what else can we yank up off the ground? Ooh, that's a... something. A vase, we'll put you back down. That's a... is that a... is that a bird? Oh no, I, I've descended to the earth. Oh, I don't know how to get back up. Oh, apple! Oh god. Let me- let me have the apple! Okay, oh, I just press- I press B. Or, yeah, I just press B to get out of that. Okay, well, for next time, hopefully that's all we need. Okay, just put the apple on the ground. Okay, I guess the bird is not grabbable. <laughs> Traffic cone! More birds. Hello! Haha, <laughs> hello! Thanks for helping with my kite earlier. The wind has picked up, did you see? But all that kite flying has made me thirsty for a drink. Do you want a boba tea that I will steal from the this, from this statue? Here. Give. Oh, can I talk to you now? Okay. I love cold drinks. Bubble tea is my favorite. Did you take this off someone else? Whatever, I don't care. Oh, Liz's favorite thing is bubble tea. Okay, I stole your soft drink, sorry. Hey, hi. Whoa, are you supposed to be here? <laughs> There's something different about you. I can't really put my finger on it. Uh, finger? Fingers? Oh, I see, you're a hand. <laughs> like a full-on hand and not a person. Cool. I'm Terry, by the way. Catch you around. Hi, Terry. Let's talk to them. Hello there. I'm Drake Dragelchup. Pleasure to meet you. I have seen you picking up quite many things. You are quite the strong man, just like Dragelchup. Would you like to see some feats of strength? Bring me something heavy and I will lift it for you. Haha. <laughs> I'm gonna take your your item. Something heavy. You are in a funny spot. Car. Can I turn you? <laughs> I don't know where I put that car. Did I put it in the movie theater? Uh-oh. I'm, I'm trying to change my camera to fix my wrong. Do you want a car? Dr Draggle job? Oh, he's gone. Your drink is still here, though. Can I get the kite? It's just in the air now? Okay. Hmm. Well, it's very dark now, so it's hard to see. Um, are there other things? Hello! Oh, great! Hey, can you help me move my van? I'm Lars. I just need it across the other side of the road. I'll meet you there! Lars added to compendium. Where is your van? Oh, here? Okay. Yeah, I can move it across the side of the road. Ooh, very heavy. Also, I need to sneeze. Give me one moment. You know, I might actually keep going a bit. Can I get the van off you at the alleyway? Oh gosh. You don't- why don't you want to drive? Is the cost of gas so high that you must ask a hand? What is the optimal path here? I think going back down. I think that tree would be in my way unless I let go of the van and then moved it off the tree. Backing it up. Home stretch now. Since you've already come this far, would you mind taking it the rest of the way? Just over here, I'll lead the way. Ooh, you are a person who takes advantage of others, huh, Lars? You know what I've done? This is classic. You're actually gonna laugh. You'll think it's funny, I reckon. This fully isn't my van. Look, thanks for your help anyway. The van is yours. 
not literally, it's definitely not my band to give, but like spiritually. <laughs> you made me collect, commit thefts. Uh, but I'm an inspiration apparently, so you know. My van now. Open! Pineapples! <laughs> oh my god. The truck. It's dead. I've caused a terrible accident. Oh, is this what was in the van? I wonder who it was getting delivered to. Maybe Charlie the beekeeper would know. They seem to like pineapples. Alright. Um, hello, human. Brought Dragal Drub a puny item. It weighs only about 10 grams. Bring Dragal Drub something heavier if you want to see a real feat of strength. Okay, well, do you want a tree? Oh god. Oh god. The, the tree cannot be given. I am causing mass chaos. Oh god. Uh, uh, I just dropped the tree in the middle of the room. Uh, sorry. Let me- nope. Let me grab it. Let me zoom out. Let me plant the tree. So I need to find something heavy for, uh, dra Dragaljub. But something that I can actually give. A tree, apparently, is not giftable. Very, very upsetting. Okay, so we did find that pineapple. Got inspiration for that. Large fruit delivered in vans. We got the soft drink, a cold drink that can be bought in shops and vending machines or stolen off of people's hands. We got the apple found in trees. We got the chewy bubble little tea drink. Um, traffic cone. Uh, the vase. A van, apparently. Beach ball. Car. So quite a few people. Uh, we have to find something that's a kilogram. Terry is the ball enthusiast? Is this the guy who made me steal? <laughs> no, Lars is the... Wait. Clementine. Who is the person who made me steal? Was it Lars or Terry? I forget who it was. Uh, but we definitely found the tree. Golden Everlasting Grows on Grass. <laughs> Cool. Bush. All right. Um. Oh, we have a lot of inspiration. Okay. Uh. I want to collect a cloud. Oh, I can grab them. Okay. Squeeze left trigger. Made it rain. <laughs> uh, we got some more people here. Who are y'all? Hello. Wow, what an unusual hand. How is it flying like that? Oh, are you the beekeeper? A suspended vapor, perhaps? Or is it held together by surface tension? Oh, please excuse me. I haven't even introduced myself. My name is Ritu. I'm a water scientist. I'm into all things H2O. Okay, not the beekeeper. Just They're just wearing yellow. Come find me if you have any hydrology-related questions. And who are you? Hey there. I'm Birch. Have you come out to check my vegetable garden? Veggie patch is good... Fun for anyone with a green thumb. Looks like you have a blue thumb, though. <laughs> Close enough, I guess. Vegetable patch. Okay. Got some... Ooh. Tomatoes. Growing straight from the ground. That's not accurate. Hey. How do you feel about the tomato? Thanks for helping out with the veggie patch. These tomatoes like to grow when it's sunny. When it's sunny, you can also find golden everlasting flowers growing around the park at the other end of town. I did find them. Mushrooms, carrots, there's like a button here, but I can't like press it. I'm not sure what that does. Oh god, let me out. Please. <laughs> I just want to go up on the camera. Okay, um, cool. Okay, so the favorite best friend thing is quite helpful for finding folks. They, they seem to have their own schedule that they're, they're on, so it can be hard to find people. Okay, this changes the time of day. That can be nice if it's like you want nighttime or daytime. Um, here's still pineapples. Is there anything else that we can collect? Who are who are y'all down here? Hello. Yeah. A flying hand, ain't that something? Thanks for floating on over and saying howdy. 
Name's Tex. Okay, what's up, Tex? Oh boy, gosh darn, ain't this just the most beautiful weather? I better put some sunscreen on. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Lars was the thief. Right, right. Uh, okay. There's our best friend. We've got quite the car pile up here. Um. Oh, beekeeper. They have a bee with them. Hmm, yes? My name is Charlie. Nice to meet you. <laughs> the bee's just in front of their face. I'm the town's resident beekeeper. May mind you, don't swat any of my little friends with that big hand of yours. Oh, hey. Haha, <laughs> sorry, do I seem busy? I'm not working too hard. Just pottering about. Um... Do you want... Do you want a pineapple? Because apparently you like them. Here. I thought I recognized that tropical smell. Did you know that bees play a vital role in pollinating the pineapple plant? It's one of nature's many marvels, and why pineapples are my favorite thing. Thanks for bringing me one. You're welcome. Okay. Who are you? Yeah? So, I heard some water cooler chat about a blue hand making the rounds, and I'm supposing that's you. Nice to e-meet you. You should add me on LinkedIn. <laughs> just for just search for Robin Debre. <laughs> yeah? I need to sell this business ASAP. Can you loop back with me later? This meeting isn't going to run itself. <laughs> I'm sure you could fit a lot more business euphemisms in there. One of my pet peeves. When people overuse those. Honestly, when people use them at all. Okay. Um, I guess we can check the compendium to see who we haven't talked with. So Birch is the flower friend. And Robin's looking for new opportunities to make money. We found Ritu, responsible for maintaining the water quality. Um, got the cloud. I need to sneeze again. I am so sorry. Okay, hopefully editing me cuts all this out. <laughs> Remembers I that I have sneezed twice this video, not just once. Um, so we found the tomato. And we have apparently two more people. Oh, up here. Charlie the beekeeper. Found attending to the various beehives in the city. And Tex Green. Oh, Tex Green is uh, the fisher. Um, there's apparently a lake, which means that there should be a fishing pole, no? Somewhere near the lake. I know I'm supposed to change the weather, but... Oh, I guess this is the lake, huh? Who are you? Okay. Um... I don't think I see any fishing. Maybe they're not fishing at night. I hear froggies. That's pretty fun. Hey, hi. Heck yeah. Sun's out. Might go to the park later. Hmm, probably don't have time, actually. Yeah, it's pretty dark, dude. Okay, um, well, let's try the other weather. Maybe that will help us generate some more people. Oh boy. Yeah, the controls are a little funny. Talk to them. Hello again, what would you like to know about? Show me a magic trick. Do you want to see some magic? I have a trick I could do, but you'll have to bring me an apple first. Anything else I can tell you about? I will get you an apple. I, okay, yes, there it is. I was going to say, I already had one on the ground, so I don't want to pluck another one if I don't have to. Let's just ignore that pineapple disaster over there. <laughs> Would you like to see a magic trick? Behold, as I turn this apple into... Ta-da! Ooh, an eggplant. Wow, unfortunately I can't change it back. This is the only magic trick I could do, by the way. I don't really like eggplants either. Shame I don't have that apple anymore. Apples are my favorite thing. Wow, isn't that just something? That's, uh, that's life, ain't it? <laughs> Alright, well, sorry that you have an eggplant now. Um, okay. Let's make it different weather. Um, we haven't done... Let's do wind. Or that's light snow, I guess. Never mind. Light snow it is. 
Ooh, our gardener has some inspiration. Ooh, ice cubes. Pretty fun. Ice cube. What else is there? I'm sure there's like a snowman now, right? Let's pluck this. Royal bluebell. Uh... Hi. What's up? So much snow about. I'm actually an expert at snow sculpting, you know? But I wish these snowballs were bigger. Snowball. Can I just how, can I just combine them? Oh, I have to roll it around to make it large. Whoa, you're good at rolling snowballs. And I would know. I've got an eye for snow sculpting talent. Let's be a team. Let's build something out of snow on this wooden pallet here. Okay. How large does this need to be? I assume we want to make like a like a snowman. Rolly, 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 roll. Oh, pick it up. Oh. Uh, <laughs> looking good, it's just missing one important detail. I'm not quite sure what it is. Try finding something special to add to the sculpture. Uh, it's really, it's really leaning. <laughs> uh, okay, well here's the carrot that we're gonna yank out of the ground. And let's just plop it on there. That's it! Now for the finishing touches. That looked like a bird, like leaning over, like a, like a kiwi bird. This is going to blow everyone away. It's going to be so realistic, so believable that it's indistinguishable from the real thing. And voila! Oh, hmm, not bad. But I think we could have made something better. I'm going to let this one go. Be free! We make a good team. Let's do this again sometime. You're an inspiration! I made a snowman. I like the little sign that tells you how to make one. Hi! Gee whiz! How do you do? My name's Snowpeg. I really appreciate you and Ridu making me just before. You've already done so much, but could I just ask for one more favor? I'd prefer if we keep the weather on the cooler side of things. Well, see ya! Rest in peace. I haven't, uh... I haven't done the last weather condition yet, so... Get ready to say goodbye to Snowpeg. All right, we haven't found the fishing pole yet, and I kind of doubt that we'll be able to um, fish while it's snowing like this. Oh, pears. Oh, not the tree. I want just the pear. Yeah, found a pear. Um, these pineapples are still out here on the ground with the collapsed truck that I destroyed. Can I... Okay, I'm gonna mark the strong glows. Grows when snowy. I was like, glows when snowy. Sultan's trick. Grows in soil. Uh, we still haven't met 99% water. Frosty friend of Ritu's with a strong preference for cold weather. Um, yeah, we haven't. Let's let's set the stars our best friends. So we can try and give them the pot. Ice cube, cold box you can see through. Snowball, they can roll it up and stuck together to make art. Royal bluebell grows in boxes. A plant can be found in snowy weather. Um, yeah, it's either I give him a car or I give him the vase. Okay, they're right there. Let's grab this. Uh, where did my friend go? Where are they? Oh, there they are. How do you feel? You brought Draggle Jab a puny item! It weighs only about 10 grams! Okay, um... Do you want a car? Can I give this to you? Oh, they're carrying it! Hmm, not bad. <laughs> this weighs about 150 grams. I'm almost starting to break a sweat. Come back with something even larger if you want to see true physical sportsmanship. Um, hmm, something even larger than that? Well, I'm afraid I already broke my van. <laughs> that was kind of the, la the largest thing I had. Okay. Uh, what about you? Uh-huh. Okay, yeah. Oh! The kite. 
Um, I don't, I don't know if I want to let this go here. I'll, 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 can I put it down? I don't want it to fly away. Hello again. Okay, let's get out of here. Yep. Um, yeah, I just didn't want the kite to disappear. Uh, what else can we do in the snow? I mean, I assume we can go ice skating, perhaps. What else is large that I can- I mean, aside from a tree. What else is large that I can give to the strong man? And not the truck, because I broke it. This... Can I pick this up? Oh, that's just more pineapples. Yeah, this is the remains of the truck. <laughs> okay, um... Is there much to do when it's snowing? I feel like not really. Okay, well, let's, uh, that must be like, I, I must need like the fishing, fishing rod for this. I haven't met the headphones person yet. Um, there's still fish, rainy weather, more rainy weather stuff, mushroom, a warm drink. Okay, someone must have a coffee. Right? Surely. Surely at least one person has a coffee. What do you have? That's a pineapple. Um, any... Any coffees? What's what's that? Oops, nope. Oh, that's just the base. Okay. Um, <laughs> this terrible car pile up. There. Hello, I guess. Oh, you're like some kind of hand. Uh, so what's your deal? You fly around and bother people? Whatever. I'm not really interested anyway. Well, I'm taking your drink. <laughs> hey, I'm wearing those headphones partly to stay warm, but also partly to drown out the sound of people who try to bother me. Well, bye. <laughs> okay, well, we found the coffee drink. Hot morning drink. That's good. And then... I think everything else perhaps is um, in rainy weather slash I need to find the an appliance found on buildings in very hot weather. So is that like an air conditioner unit? Okay, so there's still a, like an air conditioner or something that I need. Um, oop, oop. Let's... Uh, Let's change it to sun first and murder the snowman <laughs> um, so I can get the last sunny item and then I can um, do the rainy rainy weather one. Let's, let's make it sunny faster so I can see what I'm doing. So something that appears on buildings in hot weather. Aircon unit, it was, okay, nice. Keeps cool. Okay, now let's instantly change weather again. <laughs> and go to rain. Our last one. Drizzle! Ooh, the water's filling up. Perhaps that means fish and fishing? By the lake? Yeah! Okay, sorry I immediately took your fish- oh god, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Oh, we caught a fish! Not bad, kid! Hey, I'm looking to catch something special from this here river. If you catch something special, show it to me. Okay, well... We found a fish, apparently. Oh, nope. Here. A fish? Nah, I ain't interested in that kind of thing. I'm looking for something more special than that. Why don't you try again? Sure, I will try again from your runaway. <laughs> Big fish. Fishing rod. Here, how about the big fish? Ain't interested in that fish either. I want to find something special in the server. Keep trying. Perhaps the boot. 
is what they are looking for. A boot! We have found it. Are they missing a shoe? My favorite boot! Now who threw that in there? Time to put you back where you belong. Time Thanks for your help, partner. They don't have feet. <laughs> well, I'm glad I was an inspiration. Oh, new locations. Look out for the full game. More world, more mechanics, more wood, more weather. All right, let's go back to the demo. Texas' favorite thing is his shoe. Um, I have not found the little creature who comes out when it's raining or mushrooms. Okay, mushrooms are here. I'm glad I could keep playing the demo. I would be kind of sad if I like finished and couldn't go back. Oh, I guess, do you want that? Thanks for helping out with the veggie patch. These mushrooms like to grow in damp conditions. There's also a special flower that grows when it's damp. You can only find it in the hills. Thanks for that info. A snail! <gasps> that's the that's the rain rainy weather creature? I don't think I've seen a snail in real life before. I think I would probably be freaked out. They're very slimy and squishy. Same thing with slugs. Very squishy. Um, we are in the hills. Oh, there we are. There's a flower. Let's pluck that. Blue petite. Add it to compendium. Uh, okay, blue petite grows on hills. Big fish swims in water. Little fish. Small bodies of water. Um, we've got the snail that sticks on surfaces. So we've got everything from the nature area. Um, there's still, oh, we need to find the orange. So we found the mushroom. Found the aircon unit, the fishing rod. Found the boot, worn on shoes. Okay, so I think, I mean, we haven't discovered people's favorite things, but um, I'm not about to just like spam giving people stuff. So I'm just going to pluck the orange and then we can feel completed with this demo. Um, so the oranges are going to be growing on trees. Here we are. I guess these are just magical trees that grow different fruits depending on the season. <laughs> Mandarin added to the compendium. All right, orange fruit that grows in rainy weather. Yeah, so we have found everything in the compendium. Let's talk to them. Hello again, what would you like to know about? Um, what should I do now? Wow, you've completed everything developers have put in the demo. I suppose that means you win. Of course, this is only a demo and not the full game. You'll just have to wait for the full game for more. Anything else I can tell you about? All right. Never mind. Come talk to me again if you ever need help. All right, cool. Final thoughts. Uh, controls are very clumsy, but if it's meant to feel clumsy, then you know, so be it. The the camera movement is especially what I have trouble with, and I did freak out a little when I accidentally um, walked on land and couldn't get back up. All you had to do was press B, but I didn't know that. Um, visually, it's quite interesting. It's definitely going for a, a unique style. Um, very simple, very reminiscent of toys. I do like the best friend system that lets you find people. Um, picking up and interacting with stuff is, is pretty fun as well, and I do like the ability to um, complete quests. And I like how the hand changes, like when you're close to things, like, oh, you're about to pick something up, hmm, very considering pointer finger. You're about to talk to someone, you're pointing at them. Uh, you're just hanging out, you're just a floating hand, and <laughs> I think that's pretty fun. Contextual change of poses as well. So anyway, this has been Samarillis playing the demo of Wood and Weather. If this is something that you're interested in, definitely check it out on Steam and add it to your wishlist, and hopefully it'll come out sometime later this year in 2024. Thank you for watching, I hope you had a good time, remember to have a great day, remember to be kind to yourself and to others. Goodbye!